Microsoft Copilot release to individuals. The power of Copilot is like, say, you know, you've got like a chatbot. You might be like, Copilot, take this spec sheet and create a product description out of it. Now take this spec sheet and create a uh, web page. Now create a press release. Now take this content that you've created and create a PowerPoint slide deck on this new product that we have. So pretty cool stuff, right? Is it good though? Is it like legit? Or? Look, it's going to be like everything. Like these tools, like ChatGPT, is all about how you train them and prime them. Is it going to be great? No, it's not going to be crash hot, but it's going to be enough to actually kind of get you going and give you structure. If you're on the Microsoft ecosystem, your Outlook, your files, imagine like being able to go to a chatbot and you don't even remember where this data is. You just know it's in a file somewhere. Like for example, our uh, you look at our podcast stuff. Sometimes, I don't know about you, Tony, you'll be talking to a client. I'll be like, oh, we spoke about that on a show. Yeah. And I can't remember what show that was on. Yeah. But our show notes are saved in our OneDrive or our SharePoint. So I could be like, Copilot, create for me an email I want to send to a client about a topic we discussed on the podcast that was about ChatGPT. 